So yeah, here we are playing Pitfall. Um, I designed Pitfall so that you had to learn the skills, or you could learn the skills, for running, jumping, and climbing, or falling, before anything dangerous would happen. If you notice on this screen, the log's not rolling, there's no scorpions chasing after you in the underground. And um, so you could learn joystick right, joystick left, press the button to jump, climb up, climb down, and jump while running, and you can jump laterally. And then as soon as you get to the next screen, you now have rolling logs. So you want to jump laterally over them as well. And some timing is good so that you don't end up falling in that hole after you jump over the log. Like that. So here is the first chance to swing on a vine. So I learned that if I jumped at the vine at the right time, I could swing on it. And that's nice because I can let the logs roll under me. So and by inventing the first platformer, you also had to invent the first tutorial. Pretty much. Um, at Activision, we were really conscious of making a game that you could just pick up and play. Um, I have to credit Nolan Bushnell for the best quote about that, and that's a minute to learn and a lifetime to master. That's his quote for that type of a game. And now, of course, here's the screen that um, was the downfall of many people, and that was the uh, running over the heads of the alligators. Um, inspired by the Heckle and Jekyll cartoon, the lead-in to the cartoon that showed uh, the two talking mag magpies, Heckle and Jekyll, running across the heads of alligators. Actually, they run across the open mouths of the alligators that snapped just as they passed. But uh, the, the interesting technique to, um, to do these alligators is you could stand on their heads and they can open and close their mouth which is very nice. If I stood over there where his mouth was, I would actually fall in and be eaten and die. But I can stand right here on his head, kind of behind his eyeballs. But to do that now, I have to do something which is technically kind of difficult. I need to jump laterally from a standing start. Um, I know that if I move the joystick left and right, it'll run. And I know that if I press the button, it will jump. But this game runs at a 60 frame per second calculation rate. So, in theory, to do a lateral jump, I have to move the stick to the right and press the A button in the same instant, the same 60th of a second, or else I run off the head and fall in the water, or I jump straight up. Those are the two choices. That was too hard for anybody to play. So I actually put in some special code on this particular type of a jump. If you press the A button within 3 sixtieths of a second after starting, or vice versa, if you press the joystick within 3 sixtieths of a second after starting to jump, you can still jump laterally. So it made it so that instead of having the nearly impossible feat of pressing them both at the exact same time within a sixtieth of a second, just generally pressing them at the same time works out as a lateral jump. And um, if you you want to do it a little, oops, um, there is the opportunity to wait for the um, alligator's head to be, or mouth to be closed, and then you can run across that and get a little extra um, slack in your controls. But,